14 points, so uh, we can improve on that. But uh, other than that, I feel like we did a great job today. What was different in the second half? Obviously, the weather played into it, but you guys really didn't give them an inch. Uh, we just buckled down. You know, the two touchdowns we gave up was mistakes on our part. And uh, we buckled down, talked about it at halftime, and uh, we didn't want to give up any points. And we wanted to get off the, the offense the ball as many times as we could. And, you know, that's what we, I think we did a great job with that. One of the touchdowns was after uh, the offense turned the ball over and, and you guys had a short field to defend. You still regard that as a mistake on, on your part? Yeah, you know, uh, mis mis coverage. It's on us. Talk about the screen pass and, and what happened on that play and where they got you. Um, you know, just just a simple mistake. It wasn't nothing serious, but uh, it was just the little things. That's really nothing big. Because they ran the screen again and yep. stopped it. So. In the second half, I think the first seven drives, you guys had six three and outs, and then the, the four and out. What's going through your mind when you're having that much success stopping them at that point in the game? Uh, just a lot of confidence and momentum, and uh, just giving the offense the ball as many times as we could. And uh, we was feeling good, and just kept kept going and going does, until we couldn't anymore. Does any frustration start to seep in at, at any point during that when you when you keep getting short field? No, we can't. You know, we're a team. Mm -hmm. Offense doing bad, we're doing bad. So. You know, uh, you can't get frustrated with them. They can't get frustrated with us, you know, and uh, we're a team. What is it about the first half so far this season that has, like, kind of been a struggle for you guys? Like, for who? Like, for you guys, like, just the in team? general? Like, the, yeah, Michigan in general. Um, I don't think we really struggled. You know, we were 4-0. Oh, but uh, you, it's not It's a game, you know. You can't be perfect every time. And, uh, we, the outcome is we want to win, no matter how we get it. So that's really what it comes down to. After Purdue, uh, Jim said that he, he thinks he learned a lesson about this team, uh, being able to win in the late rounds. After tonight, what, what are your thoughts on that? And how do you feel? Do you feel you guys are, are there yet? Or I, mean, I think we still got work to do. But uh, you know, we wanted to come out with the win. And uh, I still think we got a lot of fight in our team. You know, we didn't give up. We were grinding the whole game. And, uh, just didn't get the outcome we wanted. Did you guys? Probably didn't ask this before, but um, with the five turnovers, you guys have to go back over, go back out. Uh, quick change to defense. Uh, was there any frustration from the defense from that? At that point, did that kind of uh, happen, or what was your guys' reaction? No, not at all. You know, uh, we know that we're capable of getting stops. So it's, no matter where the ball starts at, and uh, we did a great job with that. And. Uh, we can't put the blame on the offense or anything, anybody, you know. We gave up 14 points, and that's what ultimately won the game. Uh, Mike, we know this is a team that usually bounces back from losses pretty well, but for you and Mo, this being your senior year, does this one hurt a little bit, at least right now, that you know you won't get another shot at these guys? Uh, of course it hurts. Uh, you know, um, I told the team, but mostly the defense after the game, like, keep our, keep your head up, you know, and uh, our, our goal is still out there is to win the Big Ten Championship. You know, this one does hurt, but we got to get over it by tomorrow because we got Indiana next week. Is having lost to these guys in a just even more heartbreaking fashion a couple of years ago, does that help with the, for you guys, teaching some of the young guys to, to get past it and move on to next week? Um, I think just, you know, the seniors here, you know, we 7-5 and five my freshman year, 5-7 and seven my sophomore year, so we know what it feels like to lose. You know, we can't. We can't let this bring our team down for the rest of the year, you know. So hopefully we can move on and come out next week and get a win.